So, back with another Jubilee video. This time, strangers rank their intelligence. IQ versus first impressions. How intelligent do you think you guys are? Mm. Average? Genius? I guess I'm smart enough to know that I don't know everything. Like, I don't know a lot of stuff. I know a little bit about a lot. By saying you're intelligent, you're not intelligent. Mm -hmm. I think in terms of like street smarts, I'm pretty up there. I know basic human interaction type stuff for the most part, but in terms of like math and sciences and like computer and shit like that, oh, I'm terrible. Yeah. I don't think I could do school over again right now. I was in college and took a bio class. This class is 50% math, I said. Nope. Thank you. <laughs> See you later. So you're gonna be doing a three page paper every week? Nope. See ya. See ya. Everyone have a good day. Your first assignment was don't use your phone for two weeks and then write a paper about how that felt. An eight page paper. I haven't written that in my whole career ain't schooling. ain't even enough to talk eight about. Pages eight pages is my computer won't even stay alive for that long. I'm not very prideful in my intelligence. I'm just here. That's what I'm saying. I'm just floating around. I'm dumb. I happen to know that McDonald's gets special genetically modified potatoes that are super long so that they can make their fries. Did you know that? I didn't. I didn't know that. Play the video. Should we just like go down and do intros? Yeah. To my brother in a loud outfit. This is not the <laughs> ranking men by fashion. They, this is they the get, fashion video. They gave him the wrong email. They gave him the wrong, he got the wrong. He, he went walked into the wrong studio. Why are you bringing a bag? He got his pencils and calculator in there. And my guy on the left looked like, bro, I don't think you're supposed to be here. I think I was supposed to stand right there. But what he thought was like, I'm gonna be on a Jubilee video. It gets a lot of views. Let me wear my best outfit. I hope he's the smartest one if he's wearing that. I'm shot I'm 24. Run it back, Turbo. I'm shot I'm 24. Yes, the shoddy. I work in finance. I have a bachelor's degree. I uh, went to Yale. I'm Tyler. I'm 21. I'm a high school graduate and I work in the Marine Corps. I'm Kaylee. Um, I'm 25. I'm a software developer. She just developed my software into hardware. <laughs> Maria, I'm 30 years old. I have my PhD in cancer biology. Hi, everybody. My name is Sean. I'm 27. <laughs> Why are they all Sean? Why are you gay guy named Sean? Hi everybody, I'm Ray. I'm 24. I graduated with a bachelor's degree in Harvard recently and I work in consulting. He came in too simple. I would copy off Ray all day. Oh, he seemed like a cool person, cool smart guy mm -hmm. too. Mm -hmm. Off rip the Marine dude or something. Oh, you're on the end, brother. Like he said high school graduate as is one of his accolades. Like Sir, high yeah. school graduate did it. Everyone. <laughs> anybody can get that. Sir, yeah, um, two hands. <laughs> I got two hands. Yeah, bro, everyone does. I'm 5'11 too, and you know. <laughs> I think intelligence is better defined as your adaptability and your problem solving skills more than it is your education. Obviously, like the education, the stuff you've been through puts a lot into playing it because it gives you more resources, more thoughts to draw from. Loosen up, brother. I do agree with him though. You don't need to go to every school to be the smartest person. People consciously or unconsciously, when they see someone, form an opinion immediately. Like I'm sure we all did right away. I like her in the white. I need me a software developer. I'm in love with software developer. First impressions, I would put them at the bottom only because when I was in school, all the other people with like the bright neon colors and stuff, they were typically the ones doing worse in classes. Why he's stiff like that? Sir, yes sir, put him at the bottom. Sir. I feel like I have a good combination of both, like book smart, and street smart. So yeah, I think I have some input on that. Bro, you know he doing math problems and shit. He's studying right now. I didn't mean. <laughs> he was reading books at recess and shit. Say kickball? <laughs> have fun with that. <laughs> My first job out of college, I was working at a law firm. Gentleman came up to me and said, hi, um, you don't look like somebody that would work at a law firm. You look like somebody I'd go on spring break with. I know I'm not, you know, from Yale, I don't have a PhD, but what I lack in those areas, I'm able to still problem solve and use my own skill set, my emotional intelligence, as well as my social intelligence. Besides my education and background, I feel like I have high like emotional intelligence, like I'm aware of my surroundings. As a software developer, my problem solving skills are obviously top notch. Off rip, I'm gonna say like, yeah, go going based off of emotional intelligence, which is like, yeah, your street smarts or whatever. I'm gonna judge their outfits because you have to be a certain level of intelligent to know this is some weird shit. That's why I think my guy on the end, dope, clean outfit. I will put him towards the top. White girl with the white thing. Clean, dope, pretty, well put together with the white and the white. Boom, towards the top. Trench coat, 
Takashi Murakami military. I don't know. Because the clothing and what you wear is very telling. Mm -hmm. Who you are as a person, I would say. But then again, there's probably some smart people out there that give no Fs about fashion or anything. But they're intelligent when it comes to math. Oh yeah, so they're saying, right, you have to be straight overall, smart. Overall, overall, okay. I consider myself intelligent. My mental dedication and my ability to adapt and to problem solve. So do you think that only certain people can do your job or do you think anyone can do your job? Only certain people. Uh, you have to take the ASVAB before you go into the military. That's uh, not really how much you know, but how well you can learn information. And I got a 94 on that. It's not an amount of how much you study, how much you know. You're not gonna really get better at learning. Does that make sense? Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Tyler, is that clear? Loud and clear? Understood, understood. You're getting like better at doing the Arthur with the fist right now. <laughs> I think that shows a lack of his intelligence because bro, read yes. the room, you're being Adap corny right now. He was the one that said, I'm, I think I'm good at adapting. Da -da -da. Mm. Adapt, my guy, adapt. <laughs> Everybody else is just chilling. Relax. Everyone's chilling. And I'm the smartest because when I was in the drill camp, I did it. <laughs> now give me 10 push ups. <laughs> ROTC kids that took it too serious. But that thought they were going to be a Navy SEAL. <laughs> Bro, you're not a Navy SEAL. <laughs> you don't look built and rich. I strongly disagree with you don't get better at learning. The idea that you can get better at learning is a pretty big signifier of intelligence. I'm very much dyslexic. I have ADHD and I'm on the autism spectrum. <laughs> why did you go to Yale and why did you go to Harvard? My parents are immigrants from China. and I'm a first generation immigrant as well and college student as well. My family always really stressed the importance of formal education. For me, that was something that I really strived for. This motherfucker's smart. I wasn't planning to go to college. I didn't, that wasn't like a goal of mine. My parents were like, well, you should apply to at least one college. And I was like, I'll never get in here. And then I went to Yale. If you're already thinking to yourself that I'll never get in here, isn't that saying, oh, I'm not intelligent, I won't get in here? Oh, that's her flex, like, and then I showed up, and then I just got into Harvard. <laughs> and then I got into Harvard. But it also doesn't matter what school you go to. Like, who would have known? It could have been scholarship or this mm -hmm. or that. But I don't think a high-class school makes you smart. I mean, Drexel's a really good school, and I'm an idiot. Then again, I'm sure getting into Ivy League school is difficult. But yeah, does that make you the smartest out of everybody in terms of emotional intelligence also? Probably not. Why don't you guys rank each other from one to six, including yourself? Gotta go one. No. Oh, yeah. Thank oh, you. Four. Five, six. I would rank you as a six, not meaning that you're not intelligent. I also think that I don't place a lot of value on the military. <laughs> Arms crossed. I I'd probably do one, two, three, four, five, six. Five. Don't hurt me. I'm the villain this episode. <laughs> No, you're not. You're just not the most intelligent. I'd say I'm one, if nothing else, because I know what I'm about and I'm sure of that. I'm number one because I know what I'm about. Let us know what you're about. What you're saying doesn't make sense. <laughs> it doesn't add up to you being intelligent and smart. The way you're interacting with everyone is all the proof we need to know that you're headed to the bottom. Like, that's a, not a smart or intelligent way to interact with people. You're a cornball, dude. Four, five, six. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's hard for me to look past the education part. Going to college, I think you learn a lot, if nothing else, emotionally. But I still think you're smart. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Sorry. You didn't even go to college. And you learn a lot outside of schoolwork during college as well. Mm -hmm. One, immigrant parents, first generation going to college, humble, modest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I do feel like two's pretty smart yeah. too. Like, I agree. To even analyze people's characteristics. It has nothing to do with your background. I don't think you really have the highest EQ out of all of us. Ooh, that's what I said. Tyler, he ranked last for me personally because the way he carries himself. Wow, wow. nailed it. Thank you. 100%. Smart girl. Two. He's all raging right so now. So I did put myself as least intelligent. However, if it can't be me, I definitely think Tyler, unfortunately, his way of thinking is linear. And I think intelligence is almost like a sphere. It's a picture. And right now he's only coloring with one color than, you know, with the rainbow. Mm. Wow. Thank you. If I was Tyler, I would start walking to the back. Who got the most? Sean was pretty like out there too. <laughs> but he's like, Tyler, what about? You were ever I mean, between you were ever than you. Yeah. <laughs> sure. 
Well, his yeah. face turned all type of colors. I was pissed. Is anyone upset with where they're standing? I think it makes sense that I'm down here. Like the guy who graduated from high school and then joined the military, he probably wouldn't be like high up on there. Tyler, stop. He's being really passive aggressive right now. Oh, very much so. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Without even trying to understand or having an open mind. Hey, maybe the way I interacted with these people showed my lack of intelligence. I think a big part of developing emotional maturity is realizing you're not actually the center of everything and realizing how little you know, how yeah. you can improve. Yeah, like, he's a very big airhead with what he thinks. And based off everybody even sharing their accolades, him to even think, I'm so smarter than all these people after what they yeah. just said. That's how you know you're a little off. Like, I would've heard all that and be in the military, like, okay, well, maybe at least rank myself based off what I just heard. You really think you're smarter, you think you're than, smarter than, than the Harvard graduate, the, the cancer biology, the yet? Well, I took the ASVAB from military tests. Yeah, I scored a 97. Understood. <laughs> If I was in their shoes, I definitely would have also ranked myself among the lowest. You're scaring me, dude. Tyler, Tyler, Tyler. Those eyes are so piercing. I would mix the white girl with the black girl, but I think that's fair. So number one is Raymond. Number two would be Kaylee. Number three will be Tyler. Number four would Tyler! Be and number four would be Shada. Number five is Sean, and number six is Maria. Whoa. Wow. Wait a second. Tyler's like, yeah. yeah. I think an IQ test tests something. I don't think it's intelligence. It's definitely testing something. She's pissed that Tyler scored higher mm -hmm. than her. I'm sure if you studied for an IQ test, you would do a lot better. Yeah. IQ tests are just one aspect or one way to measure intelligence. It's really on a spectrum what constitutes somebody as intelligent. I'm listening to whatever this guy says. Coming back to intelligence, it's not just your IQ, it's your EQ, it's your common sense, it's street smart. I'm surprised. Yeah, I would've thought you would've done better, but. Definitely don't think it's the best metric. I've been exposed to tests like these probably more than most people here, that already gives me an unfair advantage. I took an IQ test before. I don't know what the number was. It's like difficult. Give me some weird ass questions. Weird patterns and shit. And I was like, mm. which one comes next? And it's like, bro, what the fuck? What would you need to take an IQ test for? It's for yourself just to see? I had to pay for it. But like what, do you need it for like college? Like to get into schools and stuff? I think just for shits and giggles. How do you test your EQ? What is that? EQ is how dope you are. Do they just have like Morgan Freeman there? Like, uh, yeah, you are. Right. How do we help Tyler and make him cooler? Can honestly, you fix people like that or no? Nah, that's a lot going on. I have some cousins I went to the military, they're still messed up to this day, man. <laughs> but it's like, he might be good for the military, like give him orders, do this. I would do that he right now. Do, yeah. you know, everyone at there thinks the same too. Or maybe not. Maybe now he has to be the spokesperson, the representative of all these people in the Marines. And it's like, well, no, we don't think like that, dude. Why are you saying that? I have a cousin in the Marines, but he doesn't act like that. Something about interacting with every walk of life and interacting with a bunch of different people, I think that's how you become. Doesn't that make you more intelligent, more in tune? with yes. yourself, with other people, and other ways that people think. You that. just know what you know, and you that's know. it. And that's right, and that's it. And that's it. And anything else is weird or wrong. But yeah, the more snow globes you get into, you can be cooler and smarter. Mm. The end. Bye. Bye. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. You heard subscribe that? right now, please. Understood? Right now. Now. Mm.